Hello everybody, welcome back to our Phantom Pen channel here in YouTube. Today I will review the Mont Blanc Masterstuck Le Grand Platinum. The Masterstuck Le Grand is the same size than a Mont Blanc Masterstuck 146. However, the details are not in gold, they are platinum details. So, here in the top, you can see the Mont Blanc logo. Here, there is a platinum ring that holds the clip of the pen. The clip is not so tight and it's not so loose, so it's ideal to use in a pocket. The central band here in the cap, it says Mont Blanc Masters took. And here on the back of the band, it says PIX. The same PIX word is here below the clip. I'm not sure if you can see that. So let me try to move around here. And it's, it's a little bit difficult to show you, but it says PIX as well. Yeah. And there is another ring here. That's the ring that separates the barrel from the blind cap. This is a screw cap paint, so you need to turn to open the paint. Okay, so let's find out how many turns we need to open it. So consider the clip position. One, one and a half, and you have the paint here. Okay, there is nothing else here inside the cap. Okay. Nothing special, and this is a 14K gold medium nib from Mombla. Okay, so I think that you all know this uh, nib here. It says it's engraved that it's a 4810, I think so, the Mont Blanc logo, and 14. K, and there is a number that's not possible to see here below that, that's 500 something. I think it's the, the kind of gold that was made, I'm not sure. Okay? Ah, important. Here also on the cap, in one side we can see the serial number, and on the other side we can see Germany. It's a German paint. Okay? So, the feed, there is nothing special with the feed. I'm not sure if it's an ebonite or a plastic feed. Okay, nothing else. There is the threads here. It doesn't bother me to hold the paint this way. Okay, it's possible to post the cap here. But for two reasons, I don't do that. The first one, it's because it looks so big for my hand size. And the second problem is using the cap posted, this, key, this can create some, uh, some uh, problems with the resin here, okay? So, some uh, scratches on the resin, okay? So, let me do a right simple to show you that, okay? So, let me find out a, a white page here, not to use it. I'm almost done with all my notebooks at the moment, so yeah, it's difficult to find out some, uh, okay, so let me go, okay, it's here, found it. So, let's write a little bit to show you how it writes, so this is the Mont Blanc. Mr. Stuck Le Grand Platinum. Okay, you can see here. So the nib is a medium nib. Gold 14K. 
Okay. The ink that I'm using here is Pilot's Black. So, a small skip here at the beginning. We can write with the pen in all directions. The reverse writing, let's see if it's possible. But scratch is too much, okay? So, if you have something with uh, small space to fill it up, you can use in the reverse mode, but uh, honestly, it's not a nice feeling, yeah? And we start to have some skips here. Hope you can see this on the video. Let's take a look on line variation. So, horizontal lines, vertical lines, and we can push a little bit more on the paper, and you will have some line variation. And just to give you an idea about the wetness, okay? One thing that I almost uh, forget to show you is that there is an ink window here, but uh, because the ink inside there is not possible to see, it's a piston filler pen, okay? So when the ink is it's almost finished, uh, you can see there is an ink window with some, uh, some uh, space between that, okay? like some kind of threads or something like that, okay? So, it's a very nice pen to have in your collection, okay? If not bothered to pay the amount of money that this costs, because for sure it's not a cheap pen, yeah? And there are lots of people that uh, think that for the same price we can have two or three orders uh, Fontan Pain brands and uh, with the same or superior quality than the Mont Blanc. However, lots of people are, are Mont Blanc uh, pens lovers, so I like it. I think that worth to pay for that. Yeah, and please leave your comments below, and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. Take care. Yeah.